All right, today on Hack Your Content, I wanted to talk to you about Moonbeam. So Moonbeam is a content creation tool I've been using. It is an AI content creation tool. Um, I do have a video where I take you through the one-click blog post, but today I want to show you another way to create a document in Moonbeam, which is my preferred method. And it is the quick document method. So you access that on the left-hand nav here. And this is what you get. You get the editor. And you're thinking, whoa, there's nothing here. What do I do? How do I, how do I write this content? So what's really great is there is a way for you to chat with Moonbeam AI to get instant answers to your questions. It's a very much like a chat GPT interface. So in this case... Um, I would start a document by asking it this. Write five blog titles for the topic, How to Get Started Mountain Biking. And just hit enter. And here you go. So it gives you five really good titles. Uh, Getting Started with Mountain Biking, A Beginner's Guide, Essential Tips for New Mountain Bikers. Uh, I think the best one right off the bat is Getting Started with Mountain Biking, A Beginner's Guide. So I just simply grab that, I copy it, and drop it into the editor. Now I want to give it an H1 because that's the, the title of our blog post. There we go. Getting started with mountain biking, a beginner's guide. So the next thing that I would do is copy my title. Go over to the chat function, and I just say, write an introduction to the blog post titled, and then I copy that in, hit enter, and it gives me my introduction, which I then grab and copy and drop into the document. So the next piece of the document that I need to write would be, uh, you know, section headings. So I'm going to ask uh, Moonbeam to write those for me. And here it is. Write five section headings for the blog post titled Getting Started with Mountain Biking, a Beginner's Guide. So this is pretty good. Normally I would do 10, but in the interest of time, we're going to stick with the ones that Moonbeam has generated. And again, if you don't like them, you can regenerate them as many times as you want. So in this case, I'm just going to move forward using the ones that it's suggested. Now I know a lot about mountain biking. Um, these are pretty good sections to get started with. So here we go. So the first one is types of mountain bikes. Um, just want to quickly copy that, turn this into an H2. And I'm going to show you another way to generate content with Moonbeam. So if I select types of mountain bikes here, I go to the star, it select, select text to AI select text to AI expand content. So now uh, I'm going to have the Moonbeam AI write more about this topic. Takes a couple seconds. There we go. Same thing here, budget considerations. I want to show you another way to do this. So make it an H2. Worry about some of these extra spacings later, I guess, but copy budget considerations. And then I'm going to come over here and I'm going to say this. All right. What I wrote in was what are the budget considerations to consider when getting into the sport of mountain biking? And notice I added this, include the keywords bike shop and direct to consumer. Now this is important to note 
Because if you're using any kind of content optimization tool, it's going to have a list of different keywords that you want to have interspersed throughout your blog post. This is the way that you would include them if you're writing a document from scratch here in the Moonbeam Editor. So let's hit enter and see what we get. All right, here it is. I'm going to grab it, copy it, drop it into the editor, take out the extra spaces just so we can see it a little bit better. And here you go. So when it comes to budgeting for mountain biking, there are two main options to consider, buying from a bike shop or buying direct to consumer. So right away, you can see it's putting in those keywords that I asked it to add. Uh, so this is great because this is going to allow you to work with a content optimization tool and get all those keywords into these sections that you need. So I'm not going to write the, the full length of, of this document, but I just wanted you to see that there are multiple ways to create documents in Moonbeam. I like this because it does use that chat GPT type interface. I like the conversational interface. And uh, if, I, if I ask it a question, it doesn't give me what I want. I can ask it again in a different way. Uh, like one thing I forgot to add is when you're writing a section of a document. So in this case, let's just keep going one more point here so I can show you what, what I'd write. So this is choosing the right size frame for your mountain bike is really what this uh, heading is getting at. So let's try this, but I'm gonna have it write this section in a specific tone of voice. So I wanna, want you to see how that works. So I said, write a section to my blog post about choosing the right mountain bike frame size using a very friendly tone of voice. Enter, see what we get. It's written quite a bit of content, which is great. And we copy that, we bring it back over here and let's see, is it in a friendly tone of voice? Take out these extra spaces so we can read this a little easier. All right, when it comes to choosing the right mountain bike frame size, it's important to get it right. The wrong frame size can make, make your ride uncomfortable and even dangerous. So as I read through this, the content's good, and it is in a friendly tone of voice. So my, my point is there are lots of ways that you can use the, the chat feature in Moonbeam um, to create the content that you need for your blog post and for your specific audience. So in the interest of full transparency, uh, I am a Moonbeam affiliate. So uh, the link to Moonbeam is in the description of this uh, video. And um, if you choose to purchase it, I do receive a small commission. But it is something that I've purchased. I use it for writing blog posts along with another tool called Niches. And I have some videos on that as well. So if you found this to be a helpful video, uh, please uh, subscribe, uh, give it a like. And until next time, this has been Hack Your Content.